Well, gave her a little bit of a once over. The seat come loose. And being that uh, with this back, I'm not exercising as much as I could. And I'm not working. I kind of gained a little weight this winter, so that little spinner thing was kind of hitting the gut if you get my drift. So, getting 30, 40 pounds, unfortunately. So, trying not to, but I was a heavy guy once, and I don't want to go back there. But, the reason I started the video was the flapper mod that that material might not be strong enough. But that's only really two good storms, and this one's half. Let's see. This one isn't too bad, as you can see. That one's actually in good shape, that one. And this one is basically basically torqued. It's gone. So, so one's partially broken in the other two. And huh, that looks new. Probably a rock or something got that because of the paint chip on off right there. But all in all guys, I can't really complain. It's shooting it's shooting far. Only thing is guys like JP that got the same one notice the C Jet, he's got that MTD one. He's got a lot more of these on the MTD than this one. Look at the space. And you'll see in the videos, it's like it doesn't feed it in fast enough. So if the thing would, if it would feed it in quicker, I think it'd do a better job. But you know, for 75 bucks <laughs> and all the work I'm doing, it, I am not complaining. Not in the least. For what it's, it's done quite well. Every, every time I've tried it. So. But yeah, that adjustment looks like I don't have to do it. By the looks of it. But I do want to check out. I'm going to check the belts. I'm going to put it up as high. Well, can't go too high. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Somebody went and put this in the, in the way. What the heck? Us as a family went out this morning for breakfast for mom and dad for Valentine's Day and my sister went one way and I come home. So I'm just looking for easy things to putter and not hurt myself. So I got my chair set up. I figured I'd bring this in, let it defrost and look for any issues. Like that, that was one niggling thing to see. Yeah, that's the... I found the bolts loose holding it in, so it was kind of moving on me, so... You know, check that out. And gassing it up was a suck. <laughs> the gas can in this... That had trouble, and I used a light gas can, only had a little bit, so I had such an angle that I... Yeah, so I mentioned to him maybe we cut this back some. Maybe cut it to there, on that line, maybe. So, I might do that. I'm trying to debating what I should use to cut it with. I'm thinking my cutoff wheel should leave a pretty clean cut. Shouldn't cut or crack it. So, but can't complain, man. Can't complain at all. Only thing, I don't know. Sears did not design this well. Because, I mean, that's it. <laughs> that's all I can lift a it. So you want to do anything, you got to lift the hood off of it, off the hinges, and that hood isn't light. Sorry. So, but I can't complain though. For the first time we used it, was so pitiful. But I think it was a combination of things. The flapper mod definitely helped, but by the looks of it, flapper mod is uh, worn out already. So it did it pretty much on its own. So. I think it helped with that engine too. So I'm gonna rig up a, see if I can get this up a little higher. Rig a stand up for the shoot, for the blower I mean, so I can lower it down. Yeah, as you can see, 
I could let it go down more, but I don't want to put that stress and that's an awful lot of weight hanging off the front of that lift. Eh, I don't really think Dad would be happy if he come home and this thing's doing a nose stand. Reverse wheelie. That would kind of suck. But, okay. Well, let me me let it melt some. Get some WD on that, uh, on that brake. Because of where it froze on me that day. Wouldn't tension the belt, so that kind of sucked. I was right in the middle of the blizzard, but at least was able just to get underneath and wiggle it and it came free. So, alright guys, well, a little quick update.